Hey there friends, I'm here to talk to you about something very, very new, pretty fast, Gaia, yeah, yeah. and it's a simple but innovative decentralized AI network aiming to disrupt centralized AI systems, you know, so things like ChatGPT has launched and, you know, they have basically launched their beta product following a growing alpha phase, which is coming soon. They invited the community to actively participate in their beta or beta rollout. Well, that's why I'm here. Now I'm just getting into the community, trying to show you how to you know, get started with things that they are launching. I'm here to basically walk you through their node installation phase. Let me just get you to know about how to install their node so you could get testing or charts on which node communicates, generates um, everything you need to get started with on their terminal. Let's get straight into the video. Simply just get started with installing the Gaia Net in real time. All we have to do first off is to get to the website, which is GaiaNet.ai. Right, it's, it's pretty direct. You don't need to waste much time. So this is a real time test here. What you have to do the next step is to install the node, and it's going to take us to the GitHub um, address, where you got the option here to copy the SSFL file, which is right here. Okay. Just going to copy the core file in here and open the terminal right here in your laptop you know then the next thing to do is to directly paste the ss uh, uh, ssfl file and run okay it's going to introduce you to the entire node thing so i'm just, I'm just going to increase my, my screen make it bigger it's going to start to run the node as easy as that it's taking some time to load this is real time happening in real time right here i'm showing you how to install the node right so, um the bay is next okay so that's on 100 and it's almost getting completed Let's just wait it out. Still loading just a little more time. Everything is happening here real time. No rush, right? No rush. This is the all in one guide. No rush. So I'm like installing the quadrant right now for the binary. Okay. Installing the directory. Let's just wait it out. No rush no rush downloading llama edge everything here happens easy i'm sure now if you don't know where to get the terminal in your laptop i think i'll just put help guide on how to access the terminals in the laptop depending on what kind of laptop you're using so i use a macbook so it's pretty easy for me to just get straight directly into the um, repository to the terminal you know this has taken so far around under five minutes right now so it's, it's not much of an issue but only just to wait it out So it says here, completed, the Gaia node has been installed successfully. You know what? Then you could run the command, right? I'm going to get the source code, right? I'm going to get the source code here. I'm just going to copy this out in order for me to run the next set of things. Okay. I'm just copy that out and i'm going to paste it for it to continue right and i'm just going to press enter you know it's going to take its time it's going to take its time to run okay gonna have a base then i'm going to run since this is the source i'm making use of i'm just gonna run the base straight guy net guy net in it gonna make use of guy net in it 
enter in there okay and it's downloading i had a couple of errors i think that was a typographical error so you have to really really be careful here you can see here i spelled gay net instead of gaia net that's where the error came from but we are down and running to kind of like getting on it and it's taking a couple more seconds to load so this is to show you the error if you make the mistake right if you get the right source you get the chance to impute the gaia in it but be more very careful because if you spell it the wrong way there will not be any command found okay if you also use here without the source it's not gonna work okay you see that there is no source here there is no source here and it says denied about twice but the moment you impute it correct source right from here all the way down to the hrc hrc and spell it correctly you're going to be able to check the json file and download it successfully so it's about three points um eight percent done here i'm just going to outweigh um, it to download fully okay I'm just gonna wait for it to download fully. Maybe I probably have password this video, but this is the, the thing real time. You got to be careful. I I use these steps here to show you that you got to be careful. If you put source and everything and you spell it the wrong way, you're gonna have the Z S H not found. If you also impute this users without source in front, you're gonna get the permission denied. Right? Now, if you use the same thing, I think this was the same thing, same typographical error, just users denied. But if you get it correct, you need to impute the source, you know, with it alongside the correct spelling, you get yourself the proceedings to be fast. So I did that, so you have to get careful when it gets to this point and you know what to copy. All right, around 7%. It's not a problem, I'm just gonna wait it out. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now in the final position. We are now in the final position. And we are ready for the next command. All right. So all you have to see input is basically just the Gaia net start. And we're gonna start doing something magical this time around. But basically, said it just took a couple of more seconds to load, and we have the URL that we're gonna use to communicate with Gaia Network. So this has successfully uh, been done. It has been done. It took me a little bit, a little bit over about up to half an hour you know it's nothing too crazy so i'm just going to copy this and i'm going to take it to my browser i'm going to take it back to my browser so that i can communicate with you know gaia there we have it so i have my api based url which i used right here you know 171722 it's here and everything is ready and i could just chat with this node right here simple new conversation um hi i guess and the bot it's going to take some time to think and respond okay or yeah so this this is it this is 
what's going on here told you this is this is kind of uh, a web 3 or decentralized version it's trying to kick um chat gpt out of the way so you see the thing with blockchain is is decentralized and things like that so get started today it's pretty easy making use of uh the command terminal right I did everything in here i got ran the node successful installed the node successfully you could too under an hour now you see that it's it's pretty easy it, over here i have just shot in the clip for you it's easy it's convenient i didn't even have to do anything other than just a click here a click there copy paste and you get familiar with no testing pretty soon as the time goes on peace out to see my next video make sure you also try it out yourself